<laughs> it's just one shocking moment in this roughly 60 second cell phone video. A 12 year old boy smacked in the face and held by his mouth by another classmate on board a school bus from Walt Whitman Middle School. Ooh. After a brief back and forth, she grabs him by the neck, not once, but twice. Hey, what I tell you about change those it breaks my heart that there's all these kids on the bus and not one of them decided to stand up. Taylor Brock says her son returned home with bruises around his neck. It's unclear exactly what happened right before the recording, but she claims that same girl bullied him in the past, leaving her son depressed and embarrassed. I want there to be harsher punishments. So kids don't even want to do this in the first place. This mother says the incident happened in late January, but just shared it publicly Monday. Concerned school officials are not doing enough to protect her son, despite a judge granting a protective order against a girl earlier this month. Saying she's not allowed to come within 50 feet of him. And my son is like, yeah, I saw her pass by me in the hall today. This isn't something that's going to go away for him. And she just gets to get suspended and gets to go back to school. Like, that's, that doesn't seem like a fair trade. I reached out to Fairfax County Public Schools. A spokesperson says school administration handled the situation in line with the student discipline manual, but at this hour cannot provide any more information due to federal privacy laws. Brock wants the school to do a better job keeping the two separated, but she also wants preventative measures in place. To where they are able to cope and deal with anger or stress. I'm hoping by bringing this to light that people will stand up for him and for other kids who are going through the same thing in the school. Matthew Torres, WUSA 9.